Hello, my name is Ethan. Make sure to check my website, ethanbren.com. From there, you can find links to all my various socials. We are currently live on Twitch and YouTube. So if you would like to join us for one of these live streams, make sure to subscribe and follow uh, to stay up to date of when we go live next. Last but not least, today we are going to be covering SMH. SMH, Van Eyck Semiconductor ETF. This, this is kind of like one of the ETFs we looked at prior, which is XBI, in the sense that it is an ETF that represents a sector or even subsector of the U.S. economy, represent, aka semiconductors. For example, you have your NVIDIA's, your Intel's, your AMD's, all of them represented here by this subsector ETF. I don't know if you can call it a major market index, but it's definitely one, and it's a popular one at that. So, what is it we find interesting about? these companies well for starters it has a dividend of 0.82 percent so this being a subsector of what is u.s tech right the nasdaq offers a 0.6 ish percent dividend year over year and is very tech focused this is a subsector of tech and it offers a 0.82 so it's slightly better in that regard what else does this uh etf has going for it well, let me quickly mark, go through and mark the uh, every time the RSI has bottomed out here. Now, keep in mind, we are looking at a weekly time frame always. Whenever we are covering, covering these symbols, come up here. We have the symbol, and next to it, there's a letter. This W stands for weekly, and it means every candle here represents one week of time. Now... These things don't happen overnight. They don't happen a week from now. They don't even happen a month from now. But if you're patient and recognize when we have these opportune times to buy in, when the markets as a whole are low, you know, you can be greedy when others are fearful and fearful when others are greedy. You can scale in and in, into these investments that will carry you for years to come, right? Years to come. You want to be always focusing big picture. Don't get caught up in emotional over these tiny five-minute candle, intraday, oh, I bought it yesterday and now it's down 1% today and I'm freaking out. If you can't hold through 1%, how, how, how do you expect to make it hundreds of percent in, in, into the sky, right? You know, If 1% kind of throws off your mental it's going to be hard for you making it from the bottom all the way to the top, right? Right now, we are currently projecting as much as 131% gain in SMH, which is a subsector ETF for semiconductors, right? So it's if we're expecting 131% in what is the semiconductor industry, its underlyings, you could expect to grow as much, if not more than that. Because when an index moves a little, its underlyings can move a lot. I'm going to quickly pull up the underlyings here. So, as you can see, the top 10 holdings in this uh, SMH semiconductor ETF is Taiwan Semiconductor Manufacturing, NVIDIA Corp, ASML Holdings, Qualcomm, Advanced Micro, that's AMD, then you have Intel, you have Texas Instruments, you have Broadcom, you have Micron, and then you have Applied Materials. AMAT, great company. Intel, great company. NVIDIA, great company. These are all very household names that I'm sure some of you actually already have some of these in your portfolio. Uh, but you don't just want to be rooting for your favorite name. You need to recognize that they're all in this together. It's not about pitting one company against the other company because that's going to get you nowhere. You either see the vision or division these we're, we're, we're all playing on the same playing field with the same board in front of us like if you like one of these companies you you're basically supporting all of them because the entire sector is about to move this is a very sectoral thing this isn't a tribalist fanboyism right so back to the rsi currently the rsi is touching down at that 30 this is a bullish symbol you want to be buying low and selling high the last time this has happened was march 2020 what happened after that SMH, this symbol proceeded to grow as much as 215%. Prior to that, there wasn't a time when the RSI touched down at that 30 in December 2018, and it ran 88.5%. A time before that was February 2016. 
February 2016. RSI touched down at that 30, and it proceeded to run as much as 142%. These are gigantic ranges, guys, gigantic. Um, and before that, we had May 2012. RSI touched down at that 30, ran as much as 115%. So it's very common for this symbol to run over 100%, even 150% with these moderate pullbacks, moderate pullbacks, which we have already gone through. You've already gone through that, right? So you need to be able to recognize these opportune times to be scaling into some of the most high quality assets the market has to offer. Uh, SMH is a great symbol. There's also adjacent symbols that also represent the semiconductor industry, such as SOXX from iShares. So it just depends if you like Van Ake or, or, or iShares more. It could also be a matter of SMH currently being at $191 per share and SOX being at $330 per share. So if your broker doesn't have access to fractional shares and you want to get in more granularly, the smaller share price might be a little easier. And again, from a current price of $191, we are currently projecting a gain of as much as 122%, putting its price at around $428. That's pretty much everything I have to say about SMH. Thank you guys all so much for watching the stream today. I really appreciate it. Everyone who stopped by, we've been streaming for about three hours now. Uh, Again, thank you so much. My name's Ethan. Make sure you check out my website, ethanren.com. From there, you can find links to all my various socials. We are currently live on YouTube, Twitch, and ethanren.com. Let me double check. Well, not double check, but show you guys. This is my website. This is my website. Go check it out. We did some restructuring over here. You can view our Discord even without an account, without even being signed in by using this little crate at the bottom right access to the discord with this purple button merch store right here some of the stuff we have available shirts right it's also very responsive we just did some tinkering last night that really sped up the speed of my website youtube twitch look that's us we're live right now guys articles blog posts products Twitter. So go check out the website. Pretty proud of it. I've been working pretty hard on it. Uh, other than that, that's been everything. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Look forward to all of these being posted on YouTube in the form of highlights within a week or so. And thank you guys so much.